told my mom when I was five years old that I was going to adopt and I was going to adopt older. Yeah. Because that was when I found out that my dad is not my biological father. The desire to be a parent, having a child you love and cherish, a child you're ready to protect and defend at any time, can envelop anyone, whether the person is a celebrity or not. As a parent, your child is the most treasured part of your life, and it doesn't matter if it's your biological child or not. For some celebrities, everything comes easy to them, no matter what it is. But some find it difficult getting a child of their own, which makes them take the conscious decision of adopting. And there is more than one way to grow a family. For some of these celebrities, the adoption process was an experience they will never forget and holds cherished memories. And in this video, we will relive these memories with them. But before we begin, please help our channel grow by liking this video and subscribing. Now, let's dive in. Number one, Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt. When you have that many children, they really take care of each other. They help me. I'm not alone managing everything. They are an amazing team. In 2002, Angelina Jolie adopted her first child, Maddox, from Cambodia with her ex-husband, Billy Bob Thornton. Then, later in 2005, Angelina adopted another child from Ethiopia called Zahara. She adopted her son Pax in 2007 as a single parent. At the time of their marriage in 2014, Brad Pitt legally adopted all three children, which now that the couple is split, caused complications as custody of their six children, including the three biological ones, made their divorce negotiations drag on for a very long time. Number two, Sandra Bullock. She's our world superhero. She's the one that's gonna save the world and our family, so. In an announcement to People Magazine, Sandra Bullock mentioned that she and her ex-husband, Jesse James, had been in the process of adopting a child, and the child, Lewis, had begun living with the couple in 2010. Later on, after her divorce with James, Sandra officially adopted Lewis. She also adopted a daughter, who she named Layla. The Oscar winner's announcement about adopting a child came as a surprise to everyone, as no one was expecting that she would be adopting a child. Number three, Sia. Sia, you adopted a son, didn't you? I did, I actually adopted two sons um, last year. In May of 2020, Sia disclosed that she had adopted two teenage sons. During the interview, Sia mentioned that although she planned on getting children of her own, after her divorce, she decided to go down the adoption route. Sia's adoption of the two teenage boys saved them as they were nearly due to leave foster care at 18. She adopted them when they were 18 and mentioned in an interview that they are both currently 19 years old. Although Sia later regretted opening up about the adoption of her two sons and mentioned in an interview that she was just excited as a new mom. Number four, Kristen Davis. Do you have a boy now? I do have a boy. His big sister. <laughs> yes. In 2011, Kristen Davis adopted her daughter Gemma, who is African American. Later on, in 2018, she also adopted her son, Wilson, and in an episode of Jada Pinkett Smith's Red Table Talk, she revealed that she tries her best to make her children feel at home in the black community. She talked about how it's important to them they're not separated from the black community, and how she keeps trying her best to build as many bridges as possible for them so as to make sure that they have access to the community. Number five, Jim Caviezel. I always wanted my own stock, so I never thought of uh, adopting too much, uh, and I just didn't think I was cut out for it. Best known for his role in the TV series Person of Interest, Jim Caviezel and his wife Carrie have adopted three children from China who had cancer. In an interview about his children, Jim mentioned that two of his children had brain tumors and one had cancer sarcoma. He also mentioned that although their chances of survival weren't high, he was able to change for the better because of them, striving hard to be a better man. He also mentioned that his previous belief that the feelings you have for adopted children will be completely different for what you feel for your biological children has changed too. Number six, Madonna. The more kids you have, the more responsibilities you have, the more you have to really be um, aware of time. Although Madonna has two biological children with her exes, an adopted son, David, which she adopted in 2006, and an adopted daughter, Mercy, she recently adopted twin girls from Malawi. 
she officially announced on Instagram about the adoption of the twin girls and how overjoyed she was to have them in the family. Madonna mentioned that she was really grateful to everyone in Malawi who made the adoption possible. Madonna currently has six children, with four of them being adopted. Number 7. Michelle Pfeiffer Actress Michelle Pfeiffer opened up that she was in the process of adopting her daughter Claudia Rose when she met her husband David Kelly. Michelle opened up to People magazine about how she was criticized and had to face prejudice for adopting a mixed-race child. She talked about how surprised she was at their actions and how she couldn't believe that people still put much emphasis on those kinds of things. Number 8. Lionel Richie When we adopted her, I said to her mother, that's a charm little girl. You must have heard of Lionel Richie's daughter Nicole, but did you know she was adopted when she was just three years old? Lionel Richie and his wife Brenda Harvey knew Nicole's biological parents who were not able to provide for her financially. After living with them for a while, Nicole was officially adopted at the age of nine. In an interview with Piers Morgan in 2015, Lionel opened up about how he already fell in love with his daughter even before adopting her. Number 9. Rosario Dawson So I was like, you know what, I'm going to, when I get older, I'm going to adopt her. When Rosario Dawson decided to start a family, she also went down the adoption route, adopting her 11-year-old daughter, Isabella Dawson. In an interview with Women's Health US in 2020, Rosario opened up about how she had to slowly build trust with her daughter, getting to the point where they can confide in each other and have meaningful conversations. She also talked about how lucky she was to have her daughter in her life and how she helped her get her life back on track. And number 10, Tom Cruise and Nicole Kidman. Kids, everybody has their own path and when, when they find their path, it's such a relief as, as a parent, you know. After their meeting on the set of a movie, Tom Cruise and Nicole got married in 1990 and adopted two children together. After their split, both children stayed with Cruise and have grown apart from their mom, who is now married to Keith Urban and has two biological daughters with him. Nicole opened up that staying with Tom Cruise was the children's decision, and she didn't have a choice in the matter. In 2015, the daughter, Isabella, married Max Parker without inviting her mom who was working in London, not far from where the wedding took place. Whether adopted or not, a child can play a big part in the growth of the parent both as an individual and as a parent. Although in some places, adoption is still being frowned upon and individuals with adopted children are being criticized endlessly, having these celebrities adopt children they care about can be the push that some individuals need to start the process of accepting adoption as another way of raising a family. And that rounds out our video of Top 10 Celebrities with Adopted Children. We thank you guys so much for watching our video. If you haven't already done so, please click the subscribe button, like this video, and click that bell notification so you're updated the moment we have more amazing videos. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time.